Oh boy, this was a big one, and it was epic. I got to travel a couple states over to Michigan for the second annual Upheaval Festival in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Two days of rock and roll, and it was epic. So many bands performed, like Breaking Benjamin, Disturbed, The Return of Mudvayne, Avatar, The Warning. Ugh. Now, I've been doing rock festivals for quite a few years now, since 2009, and Upheaval is easily one of the best ones I've ever been to. It's the most organized, everything just happens on time, and it was a blast. But some of my absolute favorites had to be Mudvayne just blew me away. It felt like I was in the year 2000 again because they started putting on the makeup again from their personas from those times. Now, the first time I ever saw Mudvayne was for the Pedal of Metal tour years ago, and it was awesome, don't get me wrong, but there was just something special about them with their personas and the makeup. And seeing them in that again was something to behold, dude. It was so cool to see. My second favorite had to be Nothing More. Nothing More just has so much energy on stage. And Johnny Hawkins, the lead singer of that band, I don't know where he got his vocal training from, but let me tell you, dude, that guy can sing. That guy can really sing. But some of my newer favorites, too, are other bands like Avatar was one of them. There was this newer band out there called Oxymorons that was O-X-Y-M-O-R-R ONS, and they explained to us on stage that they couldn't call themselves oxymorons with one R because someone else held the copyright, so they just added an extra R and they're able to bypass it also. But something about the festival is just so much fun because you get to do like food trucks and such, and just everyone's just vibing, having a good time. Theory of a Dead Man was a blast. I mean, the disturbed rock did. And I love the festival. And here in the Midwest, there's plenty of them. I mean, you have, like, up north, you have Rock Fest. Michigan, you have uh, the one I went to, Upheaval. And then even if you travel a little bit to Ohio, which is, like, that way, I don't forget where it's at. You have Incarceration. So if you haven't checked out one of these rock festivals yet, make sure you do. Otherwise, there's great things in town, too, like the Double Z in Cedar Rapids has every Friday night. They have live music. So, yeah, not quite a festival, but once you start combining all the dates, you got something to do every single Friday, man. So make sure you check out some of these because Upheaval was an absolute blast. And I cannot wait until I'm able to go again because it's a good exercise, too. And the food is awesome.